So in this video, I'm gonna show you how to set up a Facebook Business Manager account. Hey guys, this is Lester Diaz, and a few days ago, I uploaded a video showing you guys how to contact Facebook support and how to live chat with someone at Facebook if you needed help with your Facebook account. In that video, I mentioned that you needed a Facebook business account if you wanted to actually live chat with someone. So if you don't know what a Facebook business account is, it's basically your Facebook profile under a Facebook business manager, which is simply an all-in-one tool that Facebook offers for free to businesses to manage all your properties. So for example, your Facebook business pages, your ad accounts, your audiences, uh, the people in your team, you can manage all of that within one Facebook business manager. So you're not paying anything extra. You don't even need to have a business in order for you to set up a business manager account. So let me show you exactly how it works and what you need to do. All right, so the first thing you wanna do is you wanna go on Google and type Facebook business manager. Simply click on that link right there, business.facebook.com. And it's gonna take you to this page. Now this page, it's going to explain exactly what a business manager is. And as you can see, it's completely free. You don't have to pay anything extra to set up a business manager on your Facebook profile. And it works inside your Facebook profile. If we scroll down here, you can see why choose business manager if you need more than one ad account. That's one of the main benefits of setting up a business manager is that you get multiple ad accounts. So if you need to set up multiple types of ads, or one of your ad accounts gets shut down for any reason, you, at least you have more ad accounts that you can use for your advertising. So also if you need to request access to pages or ad accounts, um, and there's a lot of benefits, and one of the main benefits is that uh, you do get some additional analytics and information uh, all in one place. So in order to set up your business manager, all you have to do is on this page, click on create account. Once you click on that link, it's gonna ask you to name your business manager account. In this case, I'm using a dummy Facebook account just to show you guys what's the process of setting up the business manager, but it's quite simple to follow. If you do have a business, you can definitely use your business name there, or you can simply just type your own name. And then for business email, you can definitely use a business email if you have one specifically for business. And if you don't have any business email or any other email, you can simply just use uh, your email that is attached to your Facebook profile. All right, so once you have that in there, all you have to do is click on submit. You'll get a confirmation just like this. So your next step is to check your email so you can confirm your business manager and activate it. So in your email, look for that email name, confirm your business email, and then click on confirm now. All right, so once you confirm your account, this is what you'll see. This is inside the business settings for your business manager. Now, if you notice on the left-hand side, there's multiple options for you. Now you can start adding people to your business manager. If you wanna give them individual access to pages, to ad accounts, you can do all of that from this section. And now on accounts, you'll see that you can manage your pages, your ad accounts, your business asset groups, your Instagram accounts, your WhatsApp accounts, you can manage all of that under accounts. Data sources is mostly about audiences if you're building multiple audiences to target with your Facebook ads. And then if we scroll down, you can see that we have payment methods, uh, requests, notifications. So in a nutshell, this is what the business manager is all about, having all of that organized in a single account. And when you log in into your Facebook profile, you'll be able to simply access your Facebook business manager by going to business.facebook.com. If you're automatically logging into your Facebook account, it will take you directly to your Facebook business manager. So if I click on pages right here under accounts, you can see that I can add, basically I can add a page, I can request access to a page, or I can simply create a new page. So, so if you have already created multiple Facebook pages within your Facebook profile, you need to add those pages and those ad accounts to the business manager. So now you have all of that in one place. So to simply add a business page, all you have to do is click on add a page. You type the name of the page. You must be an admin of that page in order to add 
that page to your business manager. Once you type the name of the page, simply click on add page and that page is going to be added to your account. So as you can see, setting up a business manager is fairly simple to do. It takes just a few minutes to set up. And once you have your Facebook business manager, if you have any Facebook pages or any ad accounts that you've been using in the past for Facebook ads or to advertise your business or advertise anything, then you can move all of that onto your business manager and just manage the whole thing from your business manager so you have access to everything with one simple click. Once you have your Facebook business manager set up, now you have a Facebook business account, which means you can contact Facebook anytime and ask them for help in regards to any issue you might have with your Facebook account. And if you guys wanna watch that video on how to contact Facebook support, I'm gonna put a link in the description below. Also, if you want to learn how you can actually take your Facebook account to the next level and actually make money from your Facebook account, I have a bunch of videos on my channel that can show you how to monetize your Facebook pages and how to actually make a full-time income. So if you enjoy this video, I would highly appreciate it if you hit the like button below. It's really gonna help me out. Also, if you haven't subscribed already, subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to reach 50,000 subscribers on this channel right now. And I post a lot of content about Facebook marketing, Facebook tips, making money on Facebook. So if you're into that, consider subscribing. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in my next video.